Hello there kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Skyrim. Alright, when we left off, we were beginning to join the Imperial side in earnest with the reunification of Skyrim, and we were going to regain the Pale, but I realized that there's still some loose ends that I have to tie up. Uh, specifically with Kijaro, uh, or Kajo, I think that's how you pronounce his name. It's really hard to pronounce Khajiit names sometimes. And I believe he's heading down this way. Yeah, there he is. The hit's caravan anyway. So I'll hit Kynes Grove and hopefully hit them on his way back. Hopefully. Man, vampire lords are ugly motherfuckers. Jesus. <laughs> This is why we're not a vampire lord, kiddies. Alright. Whew. I've just been drinking cold drinks today. I'm actually more than most of the way done with this one. Alright, and... Where's he at this time? Is he... Damn, I misjudged. He's actually all the way down that way. Okay. Well, uh, we could at least see if we can head up to, yeah, the head up here. And we can talk to carriage drivers about the moth priest that we we're supposed to be looking for. Because that's also a loose end we kind of need to tie up, like, quickly. And, you know. <laughs> This would be nice. Alright. Jeez. So many mountains around this place. Place. Blah. I was midway through like a small burp and then it just made my mouth shape go bleh. Bleh. What? Is up with this. Okay. We are not welcome in the cities, so we make our camps outside the walls. Fair enough, Rosinda. But, uh... What? Um, who's the one who sells stuff for you guys? Serana? Yes? Have you been here the whole time? Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Alright then, uh... I thought I left you back at your little place in, uh... Alright. Alright. In that case. But, uh, I'm gonna figure out... This one oh, Madron. There, there he is. Yes. I know he's the one I that... welcome you, friend. How may I serve you? Ah, uh, what have you got for sale, my friend? Take a look. Sounds good. All right. Uh, let's see what they got. Whoa, draining, devouring. Whoa, didn't think they'd have one of those. Okay. Poisons and healing potions. Need the healing potions. We always need those. Uh, Magico would be nice. Uh, anything else? Anything else that would be good? Empty soul gems. Those are always helpful. Uh, no empty lesser soul gems? Okay. Unusual, but alright. Yeah, we'll call that good. He has a lot of saber cat pelts. One would have thought that would be, be like, you know, really, really weird for him to be holding. <laughs> the Lord knows it feels weird for me to be holding them. Uh, let's just sell him some stuff that I would not be drinking no matter what in the first friggin' place. Um, is there anything else? I'm pretty sure there is. Nope. Okay. And dragon bones. There we go. I knew there was something I had to sell them. I just didn't remember what at all and some garnets we can sell that to him too 
this garnet back together with all the other garnets. Uh, flawless amethyst. I need some of them for a specific thing. But the rest of them I can sell off. There we go. Okay. And yeah, I think I have pretty much enough of everything else. Sell these. And yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. May your road lead you to warm sand. What? Where did you come from? Oh. Okay. Okay, ancient vampire. Not good. Jeez. Okay. They were really strong. Good thing I had that one set on me the entire time. Because I think you would have killed the Khajiits really quickly. I am staying out of this. Oh, yeah, sure boy. Okay. Got that one. Whew. Okay. Hey, you guys. You guys start running. Like, now. What the hell? Was that guy just hiding the entire time? Madron? God Wait. damn it. Kajit as well. Majad. If you have coin. I could I hope that have you treat me some lock picking. Again. But, uh. And he's gonna be stuck sneaking for a while, now, isn't he? The roads of oh well. At least you'll be, you know, safe. What? I didn't really even if I didn't even didn't even notice this guy had a Nordic sword. Cool. The road. Take a look. Yeah, let me tell you some stuff that I just got from these guys. <laughs> these guys that we just killed with you. You know, you should give me a discount because I helped save your ass. <laughs> you know, just just a little one, a little tiny one. But uh, yeah, I doubt that's gonna happen. Um, you don't have any black dresses, do you? Uh, fair enough. Screw it. Don't really need that. I think Lucia likes her green one. Uh, maybe not. Maybe I'll pick one up later. Anyway, let's sell all these steel arrows. And yeah, I think we're good. May the sun keep you warm. Yes. Hopefully it does, my brother, because it, it's definitely, it's actually, I would prefer cold right now, to be perfectly honest. The heat is slowly, low-key, killing me. Uh, carriage driver. That's what I was going to do before that whole fight to defend the Khajiits happened. Uh, carriage driver, there you are. Need a ride? Have you seen a moth priest? It's one of them imperial scholars, right? Old man with a gray robe. Yeah, that's right. You've seen him? Might be that I have, but I can't say for sure. I got enough troubles on my mind just trying to scrape by out here. Buddy, it's very important that I find him. Now that I think on it, I did see your priest. Good. He tried to hire me Thank for a trip you. to Dragonbridge, but I told him that ain't one of my stops. Ah, okay. Fair enough. See ya. See ya, bud. So, we have to head all the way to <coughs> Dragon Bridge. Ugh, my throat died. Uh, Dragon Bridge is near... Yeah, this way. Be over here. Well, shit. Uh, how far is Karjo? Karjo's all the way down here, so there's absolutely no point in waiting here for the time being. Let's head to the Statue of Meridia, and then we'll head down to the uh, Dragon Bridge place once we're done loading. <laughs> Sorry about that. Really, really hot. Need my ice drinks. Also, think I'm starting to catch a cold. Which is weird with all this heat. Or I'm catching something. My body is just not liking anything <laughs> right now. 
anything about this heat. I'll take all these snowberries because these help against the fire that I usually face a lot. Are you coming? Because there was a time before where you weren't even following me like at all. Oh. Ho ho. What are the Thalmor doing here, huh? That's a thing. Hmm. I will leave them alone for now, I think. Or maybe we won't. <laughs> we'll just see what they're doing. Oh, they're doing nothing, really. They're just walking around. No prisoners in tow or anything. Okay, in that case, we'll just leave right now. Head to the Dragon Bridge place. There it is. Small little town. Yeah, it's actually pretty small. Unless it spans across the bridge, which I don't remember it doing. It's like one, two, three... Four, five, six buildings, really. Huh. Uh, what is this guy doing? Azada Liveev? Seen some mean spirited folk pass through lately. Thought I was rid of those sorts when I left Markarth. Markarth? Did you say you came here from Markarth? I grew up an orphan on the streets of Markarth. Oh, jeez. I'd have died there, too. But for the kindness of an old warrior named Logrolf the Bent. Logrolf the Bent. rescued me and gave me enough money to get out of the city. I followed the Karth River north and came here. When I met Michelle, I knew this is where I belonged. I suppose that's it, really. Hmm. Fair enough. Uh, I know a couple other things later. Anyway, do you do you worry about raising a family in these dangerous times? Of course. Every night I pray that we don't get a visit from a dragon or that two armies don't show up to fight over the bridge. You ask if I'm worried. I'm terrified, if you want the truth of it. But I have to stay strong for my wife and children. Fair enough, I guess. Uh, you mentioned mean folk passing through town? Both the Imperials and Stormcloaks have sent riders this way, scouting the bridge and the lands nearby. They stayed mm -hmm. at the inn but didn't pay. Of course. They said soldiers don't need to pay because they're risking their lives to protect us. Yeah. And that's not about all. That. They took a heap of our lumber, and one tried to have his way with my daughter. They think they can do whatever they want. I assume you killed the motherfucker. And no one blamed you, because that is bullshit. Uh, know anything about a moth priest? A moth priest? I'm sorry, but I don't know anything about that. Okay. Try asking one of the guards. The guards. Okay, I can do that. Fair enough. All you, right, you inched pretty damn close, so though. Right out here. Being mortal, that helps a little bit. Or being a werewolf, really. I shouldn't really be saying that out loud. <laughs> anyway, Imperial Soldier. Wait, I know you. No, you do not. That's no mistake. You're a wanted man, and it's time to pay for your crimes. You really shouldn't be bothering. Well, your bounty is low. All right, get out of my sight. But you're known to me now, scum. Remember that. Yeah, about that. We need to do something about these vampire attacks. Yeah, you know anything about a moth priest visiting? Ah, so that was a moth priest then. Yeah. He rode through town not long ago with an escort of soldiers. Uh -huh. They didn't stop, just headed south, across the Dragon Bridge. Across the Dragon Bridge. Okay. All right then. Let's move faster. That's not great for my skin, if you know what I mean. Fair enough. But first, I'm going to... You need something? trade some things with you. I think it'll help. Oh, it'll help. Eventually. I didn't realize you were carrying all those dragon bones. Well, shit. I'm going to take those from you in a bit. But first, I'm going to be handing her off all the stolen stuff I have. Because I'm getting rid of this freaking bullshit with the bounty once and for all. Uh, Let's see. How much stolen stuff do I have? I don't actually really have that much stolen stuff be fair yeah I don't really yeah I'm pretty good on that oh there we go there's some whoops didn't want to do that uh, 
I could have sworn I had another one with Marcus Stone. There it is. All right, and anything else? No. Keys? Nope. And any of these? And no. All right. Hey. What do you need? Oh well, I'll shit. Take my leave. I'll talk to another guard then, because apparently that's what I need to do. There it is. There he is, more like. Duh. Okay, I, I just thought I was seeing something else. You. Wait, I know you. No, you really don't. That's but no whatever. Mistake. You're a wanted man. You caught it's me. Time to pay for your. I'll price. pay off my bounty. Good enough. I'll just confiscate any stolen goods you're carrying. Then you're free to go. Well, you ain't gonna find much. Believe me. I'll there we go. My leave, then. Where have you been? Uh, need to Anything trade good? some things. Well, no, I'm taking back the stuff I gave you. Take all these. There we go. And I'll take all these back. Okay. Is there any person I can sell them to in this town? Anyone at all? Doesn't really seem like it. Who is this guy? Are you a Working hard yeah. gives a man reason for drinking hard. Well that and putting up with a wife like mine. Hey, don't be bashing the wife. You married her for a reason. Her name's Olda. If you've met her, then you probably already know what I'm talking about. Um, I swear that woman is the most spiteful shrew in all of Skyrim. Then why'd you marry her? I think there's a chunk of ice where her heart ought to be. Well, then why did you marry her? Jesus Christ. Uh huh. For fuck's sake. You had to have found something good about her. Jeez. Alright, whatever. Well, they went down the road. Or at least the... Uh, moth Priest did. So... I should be finding them somewhere along this way. Somewhere along the... Whoa. There's an overturned cart. There's also a lunar moths over here. Priorities! Lunar moth first! There we go. There's my lunar moths. Give me your wings. I need them for things. Hey, <laughs> that rhymed. Alright. Time to head over here and check out what the fuck happened here. Oh boy. Dead horse. Dead imperial soldiers. Dead vampire. Effects of the Elder Scrolls. Okay. That's Moth Priest stuff, alright. What's the note read as? I have new orders for you. Prepare an ambush just south of Dragonbridge. Take the Moth Priest to Four Bears Holdout for safekeeping until I break his will. Who? Oh. Oh boy. Ooh, black armor. I'll give that to Serana later. And holy shit. <laughs> Nikki Vampires. Weird. Okay. Is there anything I can loot off these guys other than that? Not really, it looks like. Okay. Rescue the Moth Priest. Which was right over there, wasn't it? Yeah. Right over here. Alrighty. Hey! More Lunar Moths. Hell yeah. Best shit ever. Best day ever. We need all the Lunar Moths. We need to make all the potions and whatnot. There we go. It's another one. And there's... Oh. Come on, let me pick it up, damn it. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Come on, damn it. Ah, I feel like an actual cat at this point, trying to catch a bug. Jeez. I feel like my cat trying to catch a bug. There we go. Alright. And, yeah. There's some blood splatters across the uh, road here. Didn't notice. And there's something going on over here. I'm not entirely sure what it is. It looked like fire. Or maybe it's just... Yeah, it was just the game playing tricks on me. No, it wasn't. There's something going on over here. Oh, these are the Thalmor people I'd seen earlier. Okay. In that case, fuck that. 
I'll go over to this place then. Alright. Head over here. And it should be like a trail of blood stains leading all the way here. More or less. Yeah, there's one right on the pillar over here. Okay. Hey, what the hell are you doing? Damn. Oh, I thought I missed him. <laughs> Almost did miss him. I just did basically a swing around with like a turret. Whoops. <laughs> Oh, sounds like there's a bear nearby. Oh, like, we can let him wear himself out. Lunar Moth, there we go. Alright. And, hopefully Serana will be following me still. Serana! Fuck did you go, goddammit. There you are. Alright, now we'll head inside. Yep, a whole bunch of bloodstains. Four bears hold out. Oh boy. And I think we'll end the episode right here for right now. Thank y'all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And take a look at my Patreon down below in the description. Decide whether or not you want to support me in making more videos for you guys. Or not, it's completely up to you. And I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games for you.